how to remove antivirus plus um, you're gonna want to download Malwarebytes anti-malware and I'm gonna have all the links in the description um, but first I'm gonna show you how to manually remove it um, now this won't take away the fake pop-ups uh, it will only remove the actual program itself it will still have um, remaining symptoms saying that you're infected and stuff so that's why you need to get malware bytes. You need to download it, and I'll show you how what you need to do. Uh, we'll get to that part. But what you want to do is you want to go to Start. You want to hit Control Panel, and then you want to go to Add or Remove Programs. And you're gonna once it your list loads up, you're gonna want to scroll down till you see um till you see antivirus plus and you want to click the remove button this will uninstall it take whatever you have whatever program you know it'll take whatever files and put on there off but it won't remove them all so once you have installed malwarebytes anti-malware you're going to want to open up malwarebytes and you're going to want to perform a quick scan and the scans will take a while you want to click the scan button and let it scan and remove anything found now if you continue to get symptoms of antivirus plus as those fake alerts or whatever you might want to perform a full scan and then click scan it will take a lot longer to do a full scan but um if you use this program on another day you always want to make sure you have updated to the latest definition files um, the next program I want you to get is super anti spyware I'm on. and then what you want to do is you want to check for updates and you want to go to scan your computer and now you want to Perform a quick scan and come down here and click next and remove anything that is found. This is a good anti spyware program. Um, this is just a little program that I recommend. Uh, if you use Firefox, click Firefox and then hit select all and hit empty selected. Now I ask you to for it to delete save passwords. Uh, you choose yes or no whatever you prefer and then um when you're on the main you just want to hit select all and hit empty selected this is a good little program you don't gotta install it uh but um next thing you I want you to get is ccleaner from ccleaner.com you want to click registry you want to hit scan for issues it will show you what your problems are with any of the registry files and you want to click fix selected issues and we'll ask you do you want to back up your registry click no and then click fix all selected issues and if you have any questions please message me um leave me comments rate um subscribe i got more videos coming with the latest programs and how to remove them thanks for watching